ancient days, noble knights roamed the land, doing good deeds and acts of service for their king. Many of those brave squires served the greatest lord of all, the King of Kings. Travel with us now as we ride with these mighty men of God on their quest for kingdom adventures. Oh, well, hello, hello again. Oh, I love you. I love you. I love all of you. Oh, dear. Big love, big love. Amazing love. Oh, happy, happy love. Oh, thank you so much, Violet. Here, eat your vegetables. Good girl. Well, hello once again, all you beautiful people. It is I, Prince Loves a Lot. Does it not make your heart swell with joy to be living right here in God's very own glorious kingdom? Uh, I do love roaming the countryside and seeing all the servants of the king and sharing the love, love, love with everyone who I encounter. Now, Violet, there is one thing that could make this day even better is if I had the Word of God in my very hands. <laughs> you know what, Violet? I, I can have the Word of God in my hands. After all, it is for everyone. Let me go ahead and get it out right now. <laughs> Word of God is missing. Well, maybe I just have the wrong window. You know what? It might be right on over in this window over here. Let me see if I can find it right now. Ah! Close the door, I'm dressing. Oh, I'm very sorry. I did not mean to disturb you. Oh, don't worry about it. Bye-bye. Well, it looks like Rufus is a little busy right now. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did that look like Rufus to you? Hmm, let me see. Rufus, is that really you? Let me see. Um, bark, 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 bark. Okay, it is Rufus. I'm very sorry, Rufus. Don't mention it. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, such a nice little man and very polite for a dragon. And wait a minute. Now, I am certain that was not Rufus. That, was that Rufus to you? <laughs> mm. Rufus, are you absolutely sure that it is you? And Hmm. Would you look at that? He's gone. There's some strange things happening in this kingdom here today. But no matter. I can still sit here in this garden and enjoy the loveliness of God's very own creation. What a shame. I really did want to read from the Bible, but c'est la vie. Pas moi, monsieur fancy pants dude. Oh, what? You there? Were you looking for this? Is that the word of God? I don't know. It looks like a book to me, but oh. there are a lot of words in it. Here, I will toss it to you. Ah. Catch. Oh, why? Thank you very much, kind sir. What is your name and how did you get the Bible? Oh, well, my name is Rob, Rob, Robert De Niro, and I am a, a thief. I mean, a local businessman. Yes, and I like to come to this garden and listen to the stories in that book. Uh, but today I came and there was no one reading them. So I thought, well, I will try and read the book myself. But it is so full of big, fancy English words, I could not make out uh, any, any sense out of it. Oh, well, it is very simple to understand, really. Why don't you come down and I shall explain it to you? Oh, no, I think I am safer up here. <laughs> All right, suit yourself, but you know what? You remind me of Zacchaeus. He also liked high places. Who is this zucchini? No, not zucchini, Zacchaeus. He's in the Bible. Let me find the chapter Oh, for please you. do. I want to hear more about this Zamboni. No, not Zamboni, Zacchaeus. Ah, we. Oui. Now, Zacchaeus was a wealthy tax collector, but other people hated him because he unfairly took other people's money. Oh, I know exactly how it feels. A lot of people hate me because I steal their, I mean, I make a lot of money. Mm, they called him a sinner. Oh, they have called me that too, among other things. But, but does not that Bible book say that everyone is a sinner? Ah, well, that it does, but they all didn't know that back then. Anyway, Zacchaeus heard that Jesus was coming to Jericho, 
So he climbed a tree to get a better look at him. Wow, talk about going out on a limb. <laughs> Why did he climb a tree? Well, because he was very short. I also relate to that. I happen to always be the shortest one in every group I'm in. Oh, you see, I told y'all y'all had a lot in common. We? Oui. Well, uh, what did Jesus say to him? Hmm. Come down. Okay. I will. I'll be right there. After all, if you're going to tell me a Bible story, I might as well be close enough to hear it and listen to everything you have to say. All right, voila! Now, what did Jesus say to him? Come down. I did come down. <laughs> no, no. That's what Jesus said. He said, Zacchaeus, come down. I'm going to your house today. Oh, wow. Now, how did Jesus know his name? Well, he's the Lord. He knows everything about everyone, and he loves everyone. Ah, but... I have heard this before, but why did Jesus care so much about this tiny little man? Oh, well, God loves everyone, whether they be the small or the tall. Well, why, why, well did Jesus go to his house? Well, of course he did. Oh, good. Now, wasn't Jesus worried about what people would think if they saw him hanging around with a nasty little sinner? Oh, oh Jesus didn't pay that no mind. Why, he loves sinners. He came to save the sinners from their sins. That was the whole reason why he came to earth in the first place. I see. Jesus said, for the Son of Man came to seek and to save what was lost. Well, what was lost? What did he lose? Well, the people. They were lost because they didn't know where or how to find forever life with God. I see. And this Jesus, he came to look for these people and find them. Why, yes. He <sighs> came to bring them back to God. In fact... Zacchaeus was so changed after being with Jesus that he gave half of his possessions oh. to the poor and paid back anyone he had cheated four times the amount he had taken. Sacre blues, that is a lot of money. He is crazy, this sack and Cody. No, <laughs> Zacchaeus. Oh, oui, oui, oui. But still, just the same. I would never, I, they would, uh, nothing could churn my heart so much to make me give away that kind of money. Ooh. You would be surprised how much the Word of God can change people's hearts. Are you trying to tell me that all people have to do is hear the words in that Bible book and their hearts can be changed so much that they will act just like this snuffleupagus? Zacchaeus! Ah, we, oui, him too. <laughs> yes, God's Word has the power to change even the biggest of sinners. Well, I don't know about that. Some of us are bigger sinners than others. <laughs> but thank you for sharing that story with me, Mr. Uh, Prince loves a lot. Ah, oh, we oui. So nice to meet you. Well, thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Nice to meet you, and you have a good day. Au revoir. <laughs> Prince loves a lot. Au revoir. Au revoir. Robespierre. <laughs> That's right, kids. I heard you, but I knew that it was that sneaky, naughty robber Robespierre all along. But one can never tell. If God has the power to change a sinner like Zacchaeus, then just maybe. Yes, maybe one day Robespierre can learn what we all know today, and that's in our very motto. Go ahead and say it with me. Are you ready? You Serving the escape. king is the noblest thing. Excellent. Well, ta-ta, ta-ta loves you all. Come on, Violet. Let us try to serve the king.